Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm, needless to say, what do you think? The sun's out. Yes, it is. It's out this morning. Good morning. Did you get up this morning know who you were? You did? You know what day it is? Today is May the 3rd. Oh, I gotta pay my rent. Oh, I almost forgot. So, we're not going to th think about the rent right now. We're going to say, hallelujah, it's another day. We are happy in our new day, new day. And I try to sing something happy in the morning, but it don't work all of the time. <laughs> did you look in the mirror and try to cheer that person up? You did. Oh, you did feel yeah, very good. Yes, the sun makes it better for me today. <laughs> we got. Oh, I gotta tell you the great adventure yesterday. <clears throat> yesterday morning, I had decided that I would go to senior citizens. You know, I told you about that, and they would pick me up here and take me until noon, and you could go there and uh, do things. I guess. I don't know exactly all the things it's going to do, but that's what we're going to do. So, I decided, okay, I'll go. So, uh, I told the lady that I was coming. Well, that that's the key right there, okay? And so, I decided that, okay, I got dressed. I put my dress on. My, you know, I wear dresses all the time. A dress on and uh, went downstairs. And I was standing in front of the group. You know that was collecting to get on the bus and one of the ladies came over and said your dress is uh, ripped in the front and i looked and sure enough the seam had come out with one of the tears of my dress you know that held it together and it was at least that wide right here in the front and so of course you know what you could anyway so I decided okay it's almost time for the bus but I'll run upstairs I told the girl I'm gonna run upstairs and uh, get a paint get a, a clothespin or something you know take care of this so I went upstairs and changed dresses is what I did and I came right back downstairs and then the bus came <clears throat> so I went over to the bus I'm standing in line with everybody else and the lady says Dear, are you here to see me? And I said, yes, I'm going on the bus today. And she says, uh, no, you don't go on the bus today. <laughs> and I said, oh, okay. But I thought I was supposed to be on the bus today. So everybody's on the bus and she says, I said, but Sandra said I could get on the bus today and that uh, y'all would pick me up. And she says, I don't know anything about it. I don't know who you are. Well, of course, that's her job right so I didn't feel too bad about it but I called Sandra to let her know that there wasn't room on the bus and I wasn't gonna be there well anyway <laughs> I decided that I would just come back to my room you know and because I've always got things to do you know I've got videos to make I'm, I'm a busy lady <laughs> anyway <laughs> anyway I didn't go to the senior system so I, uh, so when I uh, come back home, I, I, you know, cleaned up and, you know, a little bit because Tuesday's my cleanup day. And so Wanda calls from down at the lower level and she says, uh, they're having a Mother's Day thing. Did you see it on the elevator? And I said, no, I hadn't. She said, did you check the mail? I said, no, I haven't. And she says, well, they're having a Mother's Day thing at 1.30 down, down in the community room, down the dining room. And... Uh, so I'll meet you there at one thirty, and I said sure. So I went down there. There was quite a few people down there, and there was all kinds of uh, baskets and gifts and things like that for Mother's Day. And so it was very, you know, very nice. These two sisters had called here and asked if they could bring gifts for all the, you know, all the people that would come, all the mothers. Well, during that time waiting on them to arrive with the presents and you know the gifts and things that I had brought in the entertainment uh, the manager and her uh, concierge or the coordinate service coordinator were down there trying to entertain us you know a little bit and and they gave us some snacks you know and bottled water and stuff like that and we're sitting down there and all, all of a sudden this this 
girl gets up when this guy walks in. Now, he's not a mama. I don't know. He was just nosy, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, he come in. Well, she yelled at him. He yelled at her, and she left the room. Next thing I saw her, she was bringing gifts in for the mothers. I guess it all had passed, whatever that was. <laughs> But anyway, uh, we played bingo, and what's so funny about the bingo, they said, okay, whoever gets a bingo wins, okay? Now, there's all these gifts and, and you know, everywhere, you know, for all the mothers that are there. So, uh, she gives us a bingo card. Well, I noticed, I looked at everybody's bingo card, they were all the same, and I thought, okay, they're all going to bingo at one time, right? And... Uh, so the the lady giving the game all that you know was doing the calling out her name is glenda she said and different things your mom would say to you you know like uh things like uh i told you i told you so you mark that one off or uh don't you hide underneath the bed or clean your room you know and then you you get these coins they gave you some Pennies, nickels, and dimes is what they gave you to use to put on the bingo. But I just used a pen because I couldn't keep them flat on my lap, you know. And all the table was taken, so. Uh, but anyway, it was funny because nobody recognized that all the cards were the same. So they would all bingo at the same time. Everybody would bingo at the same time and get a present. Well, there was, she kept saying, the con, you know, the concierge, she kept saying, uh, uh, anybody bingo yet? You know, nobody bingo. Because they all had the same card, right? So she calls out another, and, bingo anybody? No bingos. The next one says, and uh, one of them says, oh yeah, bingo over here. And come to find out the reason, uh, well, anyway. So she says, no, that's not bingo because it's got to go up and down. Well, can't go diagonal, can't go across, you know, can't be four corners in the middle or nothing like that. It had to be down the middle in the center thing, be on N, I think it was, B-I-N, yeah. But it was funny because everybody bingoed at the very last time. And they all jumped up, okay, and their walkers and their hover rounds and they're trying to get up there because they can choose their gift and everything. And they all won. And I had to sit back and laugh because uh, I was already at the front to be in my hover round. I was already at the front, so I could have gotten the first slide, but I didn't because it was so amusing how everybody thought they had won, and they did win, but I thought it was a great celebration, and uh, it was it was fun, and then uh, they give all kinds of baskets full of stuff, you know, and I was thinking, oh, I didn't really need laundry basket. They had laundry baskets full of stuff, and I was thinking, oh, that's what I really need. I don't have a laundry basket. You don't have that bag I was telling you about, but anyway, it was fun, but I thought the biggest kicker thing of the whole thing was that they, everybody had the same card, but it was funny, some of the phrases that they said, you know, that your mama would have said to you when you were young, you know, like wash dishes, get in there and wash dishes, or eat all your supper, or eat those spinach, or whatever it was, but it was a lot of fun to do. It was a lot of fun to do. So today, again, if we've been out for our walk. Oh, and I got a new dress. Um, the lady that sat with me yesterday says, I've got a dress for you. Because I guess I'm the only one around here that wears dresses every day. So, um, anyway, she brought me this new dress, which I'm wearing today. And it fits perfect. And, of course, my true and faithful sweater. But uh, I'm hoping that you have an exciting day playing. If it's nothing else, then sit out on your patio or sit in a sunny window, read, read a funny book, watch a funny movie, have a special treat. Because today I went down to the strawberry patch, which is, you know, the, the raising gardens for the tenants. And I got me a handful of, of, of um, strawberries and they were very, very good. So I didn't want to start with my crochet, but I didn't want to get my coffee with you guys since I missed yesterday because I just got all wired up in the wrong direction. But this morning I did want to say hello and to wish you all well and to also read comments. So let's see what we got in comments today. I just love hearing from you guys. I really, really do. 
Okay, here we go. It says, who knows? Amy Ma, giving you a thumbs up, although I cannot watch the whole video because it's hard to hear you. I don't know if you were able to move something closer to you. Blessings. I'll try to turn the volume up, okay? I will. Who knows? And, uh, and here's Bonnie Myers. I haven't forgotten about sending you some pictures. I hope you do. I'm excited to see what you're up to. And I will be taking, I will take pictures when I put prices on them for the craft show. Fantastic. You've been a busy bee, I bet, Bonnie. Have you? <laughs> or which one of the craft shows are you going? Roadkill? Remember that one last year you went to? Was it last year you went to Roadkill craft show or something? Oh, that was, that was, oh, that was fun to hear about that. And here's Maribel is hooked. Hi, me, Ma. You're so good at editing your videos. Love all the pop-ups. Love your squares. They're beautiful. I get two hearts, a bumblebee, a flower, and a butterfly. And a butterfly. Thank you, Maribel. You're always there for me. Thank you. All of you, Bonnie and Daniel and Angel and everybody that... Jill and thank you guys, Laura and Matt, of course, <laughs> and all of you that I haven't named, like Billy, Billy Boo Boo, yeah, and Penny. I know you're all busy. It's spring. It's oh, the sun is shining, and it's um, it's 57 degrees. So it was a little chilly in the wind this morning, but it, it was a nice day to start out with. Alexa, what's the temperature in Jacksonville, Arkansas? Right it's 47 degrees Fahrenheit. 47? Today, expect a high of 76 degrees. 76? I have a morning updates routine that will provide you updates on the weather and your deliveries for today. Do you well, want to try it? Yes, what are my deliveries today? I didn't find any open orders for Barbara. Okay. I'm waiting for a delayed package. You can check its status at your orders page on Amazon. All right. Well, thank you. Stop. Absolutely. Happy to help. <laughs> Somebody talked to you in the morning, yeah, didn't that, Alexa? My sister got me that before I moved. I got hooked it up. It was really quite nice because I can ask it anything I want. Yeah. Sometimes it'll know something. It's just like Google or anything else. It's really quite different. I already asked him this question. Hey, Alexa, give us a joke. Why did the zombie become a hypnotist? Why did they preferred their brains washed. What? I didn't get. I didn't get that one. Say it again. Alexa, give me a joke about a puppy dog. How did Chihuahuas greet each other at Christmas? The happy holidays. <laughs> Chihuahuas greet themselves at each other at Christmas. <coughs> happy birthday! No, yappy birthday. I don't think that's so funny to you. <laughs> Give me, Alexa, how about a gorilla joke? What's something that's overdressed and underdressed at the same time? Overdressed. A monkey suit. A monkey suit. No, these are not funny. <laughs> Alexa, that is not funny. I don't think she can answer that one, do you? No, I don't think so. Well, remember God has you in the palm of his hand. Pray for Mother Earth, the birds, the bees, the flowers, the trees, and for each other. Because why? You are special. You are. You are special. I'm special. You're special. Now, what do you say? You're supposed to say... I am special, you are special, and we're going to have a great day. We're going to have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. We'll see what happens as the senior citizens tomorrow. Yes, we will. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow.